I'm currently the president of the Bethlehem Historic District Association. We call it the BHDA for short. Uh, we are composed of residents that live in Pennsylvania's first national historic district. Uh, many of our properties are adjacent to the Moravian church community. Uh, one of the main purposes of the BHDA is to promote historic preservation, uh, not only of our own residences and other buildings in the historic district, but also Moravian hist historic sites uh, adjacent to us. Uh, we've partnered with them in promoting their events. They've helped promote our events. Uh, we are going to host on December the 11th a very successful holiday house tour where we have pledged 50% of the profits to historic Bethlehem museums and sites for their use in a shutter restoration project. It'll be on Saturday, December the 11th from 10 to 4. We will have 10 private residences on the tour, plus the Moravian uh, Single Sisters house will be on the tour and the Central Moravian Church. You'll get to see the inside of the homes and also learn something about the interesting history of some of the people that have lived in Bethlehem in years past and what they've contributed to the city that you see today. One of the things that I think we'll all take away from COVID-19 is how much we all rely upon one another and how interrelated our lives are and that it definitely includes the Historic District Association and the Downtown Business Association. We made a point in our newsletters to promote different uh, businesses that were offering services for carryout. And in conjunction with the Holiday House Tour, many of the businesses have already pledged to advertise in our tour book. And as a thank you to them, we are giving them free advertising for the rest of 2021 and all of 2022. We have a website, it's www.bhda.org. Uh, you can go on that. It, uh, it's kept reasonably current and uh, you'll see that we reach out just beyond our four corners to other activities that are going on within the city of Bethlehem. It's probably the best move my wife and I made was to live in the city of Bethlehem. You have culture, you have educational facilities, you have dining, you have retail activities, plus all the you're surrounded by history here and I've been a history buff for the last 45 years so it was just a, such a natural move to move here.